I'm finna have a heart attack. Think about it, they did that. But watching they Max Kellerman, dumbass, top five point guards ever. I think it was the, the one of the, the, the wasted two minutes of my life. I read it sit in traffic, in Houston traffic. Did to listen to Max Kellerman, top five, or anything Max Kellerman really ever had to say. Max Kellerman, dumbass. Max Kellerman just said, this is top five this for, for Christ's sake. Isaiah Thomas at top, top five. Cool. Good. Four. Oscar Robinson. Cool. Never seen him play. As he said, he never seen him play neither. Three, he got Steph Curry. He said Steph Curry never, his, his, his beef for Steph Curry is he never, as Boston blowing these balls out already. Steph, uh, Steph Curry said, as he says, uh, Steph Curry. Steph Curry, this is, this is one of my biggest beefs. He said Steph Curry, and he never want to find MVP. At whether, he never want to find MVP, but he played in five. Final. That's my group. He's not his usually normal self. So Steph Curry for his career is like a 24-point game score. Steph in the finals is 26 tonight. Steph is two points better in the... In the uh, Steph Curry is two points better... In his career average, and then he's two points better in the final. He's two points better in the final than he is in the career. So he's 26 in the finals and 24 for his career. This fool, Max Kevin, just said he's not his normal self. I can slap the everybody in the world know that Steph Curry should have won the finals MVP that first championship round. He averaged 26 in that finals. He only averaged two was the MVP of the league. He only averaged 23.8, but he averaged 26 in final. And somehow he don't get final MVP. They gave it to Iguodala and Max and, and Max Kevin. These media, you see how history has to be told the right way. I'm on this channel for history to be told the right way. Killing narratives is what I do and what I'm going to do for the mainstream media. It's just full of lies. This fool, then he had Magic Justice number two. I'm like, if you got Magic number, number two, who is, who is number one? And I'm thinking in my head as I'm watching. Please don't tell me this fool got LeBron James number one. Please don't tell me this fool got LeBron James as number one point guard of all time. Magic Johnson number two. Voila. I guess you know one guy. Guess who's number one? The number one all time point guard in Magic Kimmel list. LeBron James. It's sickening. It's sad. It's disrespectful to Magic. It's even disrespectful to Chris Paul because Chris Paul is a better point guard than LeBron James. Chris Paul is a better point guard than LeBron James. Every team Chris Paul goes to, they get drastically better. Drastically. The last five years of LeBron James' career, he only made the playoff last four years. He only made the playoff twice. He missed it two times. He missed it two times with the Lakers. His first two years in the, his first two years in his career, he didn't make the playoffs. This LeBron James, the best point guard, the best passer, shit has to stop. He's not even better than than Pista Pista Pitt Maravich. You watch Pista Pitt Maravich. like this shit has got to stop. This shit is LeBron James. Only thing he's good at passing is driving to the basket and finding open three point shooters. If you don't have three point shooters and bigs that can shoot threes, he's how how good as a passer guy is if the guys are not making shots. He never he averaged ten assists one time in his career. Magic for his career is 11 assists for his all game. Chris Paul and Magic Johnson has a, a career higher assist average than LeBron James. I know we want to say this. That, that's, he's a pass first guy. No, he's not. He take more shots than Kobe Bryant. He he take more shots than Kobe Bryant for his career. He take more shots than Kevin Durant for his career. As Miami he getting blowout in his first quarter. They, everything in transition. Everything is easy for Boston right now. But, uh, yes, so, getting killed on offensive boards, they, they, they can't get no shot, they tend for the pull-up for a three, three, we down 18, oh, air ball, take down 15, it's still early, but anyway, this LeBron James notion, he's the best point guard over Magic, it's absurd to me, is he a better, another turnover, Miami is, 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 is trash right now. Like, this is a game seven. You, you have all these turnovers? But anyway, I'm distracted by this this game seven. But this is giving me dick how, how we going to see a blowout in the game seven. On your home floor, you're going to blow out. But anyway, he's not better than Chris Paul. Chris Paul, go, Chris Paul with the Hornets, but David West makes the playoff. Chris Paul with Lob City. Turn that Clipper franchise all the way around. Goes to Houston with James Harden. Make the conference final. If he don't get hurt, who knows? And game six, who knows if he ain't there? But I always say, hey, Andre Gadal was hurt game six and seven. So I think Gadal is just as important on the defensive side as Chris Paul was just as important on the offensive side. So I always balance. I say, go say we should have won. 
But we never know. He got hurt. He didn't have a chance to compete. Last year. Last year, he go to the Suns. Devin Book and them never make the playoffs. They go to the NBA Finals and up 2-0 against Milwaukee until Giannis explode on their ass. Did he make the playoffs OKC? I do not remember. I do not know. Let me know. I think he made the playoffs with OKC. Oh, uh, they made the play-in. They made the play-in on one of those things when he went on. Everywhere he goes, he wins. Everywhere Chris Paul go, he wins. Everywhere LeBron James go, he got to have superstar talent level. Devin Booker was Devin Booker can score. He can score seven points in the game and lose. And average 24, 25 a night, but don't make the playoffs. Chris Paul go there, they go to the finals. <laughs> like, who is LeBron James elevated? Like, he took a sorry-ass team to the finals, they say, in 07 got swooped. What? I beg the difference. Allen Iverson's team was a little trasher. And Allen Iverson was eight inches shorter and 100 pounds less. And took a sorry team to the finals against the Lakers. And won a game off the Kobe and Shaq Lakers. The only team that beat the Kobe and Shaq Lakers that, that, that season was... Allen Iverson in the final game one. LeBron James went to the finals and got swept. He made it to the finals against a young Celtic team. With an uh, all-star in Kevin Love. With Isaiah Thomas on that team. Then he had uh, Jordan Clarkson, who was a six minute year in Utah. He had, he had help and talent around. And then they got swept in Golden State. By Golden State. His, his passing ability is all time great. Magic Johnson? No. He's an all time great passer, but a point guard? No. He's a shoot first guy, then he passed. Stop the nonsense. He shoot first, then he passed. To him be over Magic Johnson, I cannot say how crazy and stupid that sounds. Magic Johnson went to the finals with then Jane Jane Rudder was hurt and no Kareem Madu Jabbar. He made it to the finals and won game one by dominating game one against the Chicago Bulls until they made the switch to squad. And Magic really ain't a great score like that. He didn't have great other great scores around him, so they lost in five. Magic Johnson went to nine finals in in, in eleven tries. What are we talking about? The passes that Magic Johnson did behind the backs on the run, the break. I never seen LeBron James run a break like Magic Johnson. I never seen LeBron James can run the break like Magic Johnson. I'm sorry. I never seen it in my life. He doesn't remind me of Magic. You can say he might make because he's 6'9", handling the ball like that, and he do got great passing ability. But the passes, the ability, the no looks, the behind the backs, the getting the guys open, the, 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 the layups and easy shots that he got people like, like layups and dunks. LeBron didn't get you easy three-point shots. It's a difference. LeBron gets you easy three-point shots because, of course, anybody gets you easy three-point shots because the paint, if you go you drive in and dribble penetration, the paint collapse. You guys wide open. Magic Johnson will get you layups and dunks. And half court, in fact, it didn't matter. I'm just sick of my stomach. Anyway, I'm going to draw the Western's game seven. Y'all draw the game seven. Tell me what y'all think. Likes and comments. Drop, drop, uh, hit that notification bell. So you get the uh, thumbs up button, like the video, all that good stuff.